Hi. What I'm going to talk about now is an Elmo 8mm projector. Um, 8mm was a form of film which was available for amateurs to even make films or even show films at home um, from about the 1950s until basically the late 80s. This is a super little example from about 1970. These Originally, a lot of projectors were made in Germany and Austria, and the Japanese began to get very much into the market in about 1960s. Um, and by the late 60s, early 70s, they were making some really fine projectors. This is a lovely example. It's um, an Elmo. Um, it's, we'll take the camera a little bit closer. It's got some straightforward um, rays of operating. I will plug it in and we can see it working. This model has been slightly modified in that originally it had here a sort of round plug. It's been replaced by a conventional square. I'll plug it in. Right. This model will do both Standard 8 and Super 8 film. S for Super 8, R for regular. I've got a um, Super 8 film in, so make sure it's on S. You've got a little control here. That is the motor on, and that is forward right. Then you've got the bulb on and off here. That's off, that puts the bulb on. You've got focusing this control here, and what's really nice, you have a variable speed on the motor. So if you were to do cine transfer, um, transferring onto video, you can match up the frame really nicely there. I'll move uh, here. So, if I turn off the light, you can see, you might be able to see a bit of Charlie Chaplin there. And this projector is running quite nicely. I think it would do with a bit of a service, <coughs> but it's not bad at all. Turn it off. So there you have it, uh, Elmo GPE. There was a later version called a GPE Luxury, which was slightly less mechanical parts in it. Um, the lens is hyper sharp, nice as it easy to thread. You can replace the belts at the back, um, they are available on eBay. So that's the Elmo GPE uh, regular and tube 8 projector from, the nine, uh, from about 1970.